नेक्स्ट इज एक्सपैंड कॉस रेस्ट टू पार फाइव थीटा सेवन रेस्ट टू पार सेवन थीटा इन अ सीरीज ऑफ साइंस ऑफ मल्टीपल्स ऑफ थीटा फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल स्टार्टिंग प्रोसीजर इज सेम एज प्रीवियस एक्स लेट एक्स इक्वल्स टू कॉस थीटा प्लस आयोटा साइन थीटा वन बाय एक्स इक्वल्स टू कॉस थीटा माइनस आयोटा साइन थीटा सो दैट एक्स प्लस वन बाय एक्स इक्वल्स टू टू कॉस थीटा एक्स माइनस वन बाय एक्स इक्वल्स टू टू आयोटा साइन थीटा एक्स रेस टू पार एम माइनस वन ओवर एक्स रेस टू पार एम इक्वल्स टू टू आयोटा साइन एम थीटा नाउ we want to expand cos raised to power 5 theta into 7 raised to power 7 theta so for cos raised to power 5 theta take 5 powers on both sides of x plus 1 by x equals to 2 cos theta and for 7 raised to power 7 sin raised to power 7 theta take 7 power on both sides of x minus 1 by x equals to 2 eta sin theta we have 2 eta sin theta is to power 7 into 2 cos theta is to power 5 equals to x minus 1 by x is to power 7 into x plus 1 by x is to power 5 now you have to remember one thing first of all we have to expand that power which is greater now between powers 7 and 5 7 is greater that is we have to expand x minus 1 over x raised to power 7 first so by pascal rule i hope you all understand how pascal rule works by using pascal rule first of all you have to write 1 1 1 1 seven times then accordingly you will get a triangle and from that triangle at the end the coefficients will be 1 minus 7 21 minus 35 थर्टी फाइव माइनस ट्वेंटी वन सेवन एंड वन एंड माइनस वन सिंस वी आर एक्सपेंडिंग साइन थीटा दैट इज एक्स माइनस वन रेज टू वन बाई एक्स रेज टू पार सेवन देर फोर देर विल बी ऑल्टरनेट साइन फर्स्ट पॉजिटिव दैन नेगेटिव पॉजिटिव नेगेटिव पॉजिटिव नेगेटिव पॉजिटिव एंड नेगेटिव सो दीज आर कॉफिशियंट्स when we expand x minus 1 over x raised to power 7 now we have to multiply x minus 1 by x raised to power 7 by x plus 1 by x raised to power 5 with its 5 power as its power is 5 means we have to multiply it 5 times so how it works if we multiply x minus 1 by x x minus 1 by x raised to power 7 by x plus 1 by x then there will be a table like this you have to write all coefficients over here all these coefficients over here what we have find earlier all the coefficients then we have to multiply x plus 1 by x five times step number 1 write 1 as it is 1 then add minus 7 plus 1 it is minus 6 then 21 plus minus 7 equals to 14 minus 35 plus 21 equals to minus 14 35 plus minus 35 equals to 0 minus 21 plus 35 equals to 14 7 plus minus 21 equals to minus 14 minus 1 plus 7 this is minus 6 and Suppose here it is zero and zero plus minus one, it is minus one. This is if we multiply x plus one by x one times. Now we have to multiply it five times. So there will be five steps. Again, step number two, write one as it is minus six plus one is minus five. Fourteen plus minus six is eight, and so on. that is you have to add next term in its previous term and so on and at the end terms kindly remember this thing by taking zero at last and add to its last written term your last term in next step finds out similarly you write step number 3 step number 4 step number 5 now we have to write coefficients of step 5 coefficients of step 5 uh, in terms of equation how we will write c we have to multiply x minus 1 over x raised to power 7 with x plus 1 by x raised to power 
we have to multiply these two. Total power is 12. So we start with first coefficient is 1 with x raised to power 12. We get 1 into x raised to power 12. Second coefficient is minus 2. So we write minus 2 into x raised to power 10. 10. We have to reduce powers of x by 2. Next is minus 4 x raised to power 8 plus 10 x raised to power 6 and so on. Again we have to combine all the like powers from equidistance terms that is first and last, second and second last, third and third last on. We get this equation. After opening the terms we get what is the value of x12 minus 1 over x raised to power 12? It is 2 eta sine 12 theta minus 2 as it is and the value of x raised to power 10 minus 1 by x raised 1 by x raised to power 10 is 2 eta sine 10 theta and so on. From 1 left hand side is this writing left hand side as 2 raised to power 7 into 2 raised to power 5. It become 2 raised to power 12. Iota raised to power 7. Then sine raised to power 7 theta and cos raised to power 5 theta. And by taking 2 iota common from right hand side, we get this equation. Again, taking 2 raised to power 12 into iota raised to power 7 on right hand side, we get this equation. Uh, uh, 1, 2 will be cancelled out and 1 oita will be cancelled out and we are left with 1 over 2 raised to power 11 into oita raised to power 6. We know the value of oita raised to power 6 is minus 1. So we get minus 1 over 2 raised to power 11 and this equation. Thank you.